What's up, Vikings fans? We are continuing our rookie mini chap series, catching up with some of the newcomers from the 2020 Vikings draft class. The next duo up are the college teammates from Mississippi State, cornerback Cam Dantzler, and safety Brian Cole, the second. What's up, fellas? Yo. What's up? How you doing? Um, <laughs> Good. Brian, no, no days off, huh? No, sir. <laughs> Can't. Got to get to it. Got to be in shape. Got to be ready. Yeah, it looked like Cam just got off the field. He in his car now waiting to pull up. See, well, I, get, I, get, I, get, I get mine in early and do my meets and recover. See, I do it the, the smart way. The smart way on me. Because, hey, I'm going to get out here. Cam, you were drafted first. And then once you heard the news that Brian Cole got drafted, what was your initial response? I wanted to call him. I was like, man, I know the coaches and stuff have to call him first. So I'm like, I'm going to wait. You know, I um, gave that time to develop. And I was like, man, you know, me and, me and B. Cole, we used to always talk about playing as the next level together. So I just thought it was a dream come true for both of us. You know, I feel like both of us worked so hard. That's how me and him, him became so close, you know, putting in extra work. Um, all the, all the you know, overtime me and him put in together. So that's, you know, our bond is uh, like very strong. And for us to play on the next level together, it's just a blessing. When we got, when I got drafted to the team and Cam was already there, I just knew I was comfortable then. I was like, okay, I got somebody that, I can talk to, um, I can hang out with. Like I got somebody I can trust off rip. So I just know I had I just know I had a brother out there in Minnesota with me. How would you explain your relationship? Like in your own words, both of y'all. Like how would you explain that relationship? Building that up a couple tough of years love. ago to now. I say I say tough love. Cause we just want to see each other succeed. That's it. Yeah. We don't we we want we want we want to both win. So I just we tell each other the truth. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. like we we real brothers. We even if it hurt. Yeah. yeah. Even if it hurt, you tell you tell each other the truth. Yeah, we tell each other I, like you, I think one piece of advice that Brian can probably give you, Cam, is embrace the cold weather because Brian being from Michigan, you've been, <laughs> you been from the South. What advice would you have for him? Hey, yo, and the thing is, though, I've been here in Minnesota. It's colder than Michigan, bro, so I don't even know what to tell you, dog. We both about to go through it, real talk. <laughs> real talk, bro, because if it's colder than Michigan, bro, I'm not ready. Like, I'm not ready. See, I'm just going to call my grandmother and tell her to give me some coats, maybe. She's going to make sure her grandbaby cozy. <laughs> <laughs> Get you a scarf. <laughs> For real. Since, since you guys have been shut down and have been isolated and away from each other, have you tried anything new, like any new skills? To me, i just been grinding, doing meetings all day, and studying my plays. You know, I feel right. like at this point, this is you're supposed to grind the hardest because, like, you know, everything's shut down. So it's like when you get there, it's go time. So. Us being rookies, you have to go in there like well prepared, like you know, like ready to take the right spot. So, my mindset, I really just been you know working out, lifting weights, doing the things I need to do to get stronger, faster, and get mentally prepared for the next level. If, it, if anything, I'm learning new is this, this playbook. That's the new stuff I'm learning. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, yeah. uh, like real talk. I'm on the same tip cam on just grinding, working out, trying to stay in shape and be ready because we shut down and when we show up, it's gonna be time to go. So. You just got to be in shape, be ready to go, just ready to learn, ready to work. I got to say for me, one game that stands out to me that both of you guys played in was that Tennessee game last year. You both had interceptions. I would, for, personally, I would say that was probably y'all's best game together, but now to the trivia. Brian, I'm going to start with you, and it's going to be a question about Cam, and you got three multiple choice answers to choose from. So first question, Cameron Dantzler played 568 snaps in the past two seasons. How many touchdowns did he give up during that span? A, two, B, four, or C, seven? I say B, four. Oh, ye of little faith, man. A, number two. Oh, <laughs> oh hell, in a way. What was the question? How many, How many touchdowns, touchdowns did you give up in like 580 some snaps? One? It was against Auburn. So both, oh, those are wrong. Oh, <laughs> I'm wrong too. Oh, those are wrong. <laughs> Oh, hey, we ain't got no respect for you. My fault, bro. Proof is wrong. I like it. All right, next question for you, Cam. Brian Cole was born and raised in Saginaw, Michigan. What mm -hmm. famous tennis player is also from Saginaw, Michigan? A, Serena Williams, B, Andy Roddick, or C, John McEnroe? Oh, I'm I just going to say, I'm just gonna say Serena Williams. Oh, I, I don't know. Yes. You're right. You're right. <laughs> You're oh, okay, right. okay, okay. Was that like ever a driving force? You know, ever seeing you know somebody from your area? You know, actually make it. Granted, she moved to California, but being right. born in Michigan, did, did I ever? You know, did you use that as motivation? Like, okay, I can make it out of here yeah. too. Because like it's a couple guys that made it out for football, like Lamar Woodley, Stu Swagger, 
uh, Charles Rogers, RIP, RIP that man too. But um, yeah, it's, it's always been motivation. When you make it out of Saginaw, so a lot of people don't make it out of Saginaw. So when you make it out, everybody going to know you made it out. All right, so Cameron Dantzler is from Hammond, Louisiana. What yep. famous TV host went to school in Hammond, Louisiana? I'll give you a hint. They appear on Good Morning America every morning. A, Michael Strahan, B, Steve Harvey, or C, Robin Roberts? Man. I feel like, for some reason, I feel like Michael Strahan uh, is a uh, – see, you know, you shook your head. I, I take it back. I'm going with B. <laughs> <laughs> Steve Harvey? <laughs> I'm going with Steve Harvey, dog. <laughs> nah, it's, it's Robin Roberts. She went to Southeastern Louisiana State. No, Southeastern okay. Louisiana University. So, same area. Yo, I'm clueless, yo. Yo, why are you here. saying Steve Harvey? Bro, I don't have a clue, bro. But here's the thing. That's the, that's the point of this conversation is to get to know each other and get to know each other's backgrounds. That's that's the point yeah. of this whole conversation. So moving on, moving on, I got an easier question for you, Cam. While Brian was at East Mississippi Community College, the team was featured on what show? A, All-American, B, QB1, C, Last Chance U. Last Chance U, C. <laughs> Brian, a hundred percent. Hundred percent. Cam three for three right now. Two for two. All right. Two, two, two. Two. We're gonna end it. We're gonna end it on this right here. <laughs> we're gonna end it on this. All right. To so Brian. Dan Slater intercepted. He intercepted which Heisman winning quarterback in his collegiate career? A. Lamar Jackson. B. Joe Burrow. Or C. Kyle Murray. Lamar Jackson. Both of them. Oh. And Lamar Jackson. He said, hold on, who, you say, when you pick off Joe? Sophomore year at LSU. Check my resume. Yeah, 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 he did, he did. He did pick them both off on the goal and line. Lamar Jackson. When you, when you, when you should have stayed in the end zone. Nah, yep. I'm going for all the marbles. <laughs> and then Lamar was wow. the uh, ball game. Yep. Learning something new. Learning something new. All right, fellas, well, look, we appreciate it. Yeah, see, the hey, hey, Cameron sure. Dancer like that. Let me get that out there real quick. He liked that. <laughs> the world will know soon. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, <laughs>